<laughs> You've got some pretty yeah, fancy Yeah, we got some sneaks. interesting sneakers here. Tell us here. really quick before we go the yeah. story of your shoes. So um, these are actually the Yeezy 2 Red October. So I'm sure a lot of people watching know Kanye West um, for maybe one reason or another. But Kanye used to work with Nike uh, a couple years back. And then he made these shoes. And then he ended up leaving Nike to go to Adidas. Um, and it kind of made a huge craze for these certain sneakers. So these sneakers, I think, are selling on the market right now for about $7,000. Did you say $7,000? I said $7,000. All right. Uh, did you spend $7,000 on those shoes? I, thankfully, I did not have to spend $7,000. So I really got lucky with this one because I ended up winning a sneaker raffle. Um, so I <laughs> bought one ticket, and I had maybe like a point. That's Zero four percent chance, and I spent twenty five dollars on that ticket. So twenty five dollars on seven thousand, a seven thousand dollar yes. pair of shoes. Yes, it was wow. very, very lucky. Like I said, a lot of the YouTube is. It's come down to. I mean, it's hard work for sure, but there is a, a factor of luck. I feel like in play as well, right? Where there's a lot of people that want to try to do this YouTube thing. They want to do social media and stuff, and. Some people work at it for years. They have a lot of high quality content and whatnot, but it's hard to find exposure for you know millions of people that are doing the same thing. So it's really trying to be different and trying to stand out and stuff. So I think that's where I got kind of lucky per se because it was a very niche market doing sneaker mystery boxes and. I guess a lot of people just resonated to what I was doing, which is very humbling for me. Bryson Honjo, Kauai boy, now living in <laughs> Waikele, YouTube channel, Untied Hawaii. Thank you for bringing the coolness into the studio. Thank you so much for having me. <laughs> Back to you guys. Ooh, $7,000 for a pair of sneakers. Wow. I want to know where he keeps all his shoes. All right, we've got so much more ahead on the news at 7, why small public schools could be at risk of shutting down.